iTorial Intelligent Tutorials Microsoft Word 2007 Inserting Rows and or Columns in a Table This is a continuation of the Sorting the Rows of a Table tutorial. To insert a column in the table, follow these steps. Step 1. Click any cell in the Price column. Click the Select button in the Table group, and then click Select Column. The Price column is selected. Step 2. In the Rows and Columns group, click the Insert Right button. A new blank column is inserted to the right of the Price column. The three columns in the table are narrower than the original two columns. The overall width of the table does not change. If for some reason your table does expand off the page and doesn't automatically resize, try this. Right click anywhere in the table, go to Auto Fit, and then click Auto Fit to Window. Your table will now fit inside your document. Step 3. Click the top cell of the new column and enter the following header data. Use the down key to move the insertion point down through the column. Make it a meal. Now hit the down arrow key. $8. Now hit the down arrow key again. $6.25. We are now finished with entering data for this column. Let's now try adding a row. Inserting a row is similar to inserting a column. First, you select a row below the location where you want to insert a row. Then in the rows and columns group, click the insert above button. Now, let's insert an extra row between french fries and soda. You will first start off by left mouse button clicking in the soda row. Now, right mouse button click. Now, click insert. Now, you will click insert rows above. We've just inserted a row between french fries and soda. This menu item name is going to be milkshake. The milkshake costs $2.25. Good job. You've just inserted a row and added it to the table. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. And we hope you'll come back to watch another iTorial tutorial sometime soon.